Blessed be the name of the Lord. We see in the Bible, Luke chapter 5 and verse 5, Simon answered, Master, we worked hard all night and haven't caught anything. But because you say so, I will let down the net. Here, the first time, Simon is seeing Jesus Christ and Jesus has stepped into the boat of Simon. And when we see, Simon is telling to Jesus that he has worked hard all night, but he has not caught even one and it is so hard time for Simon because his boat is empty, his net is empty, his business for that day was empty. Interestingly, Jesus has stepped into a boat of a man who is seeing emptiness and dryness. Many times we need to be thankful to God because of certain emptiness in our life. If the boat was filled, if the net was filled, if that day the business was so filled for Peter, there would be no place in the boat for Jesus Christ. So Jesus stepped into the boat of Simon. I thank and praise God because Jesus do not come seeing our education or bank balance or when we are filled with every kind of wealth. No, he is a God who come in search of us in our emptiness, in, in our low estate. And even the same that day, Jesus stepped into this empty boat of Simon Peter. And Jesus says, put your net into deep. So that was not the time for catching the fish, which Simon knew very well because he was a fisherman from generation. But he says, because you say so, I will let down the nets. Praise the Lord. My dear people, maybe the situation is looks hard. You have worked hard, but you are not seeing the results of your efforts. But trust God even in your emptiness. He is faithful. When God says something, when we obey to that word like how Simon did, we see in verse 9, for he and all his companions were astonished at the catch of the fish they had taken. What a wonderful God we serve. When Simon obeyed, even when Simon's mind might have told that this is not the time for fishing because it's already a dawn. But when he obeyed Jesus' word and did what he told him to do, he saw and he was astonished to see that he was able to catch a large number of fish. I would encourage today, what is your expectation in putting the net and you have not got? But Jesus wants to tell you, Put little more deeper. He wants to instruct you, my dear brother, my dear sister. Do what the Holy Spirit, what the inspiration of the Lord comes into your heart in prayer. And when you do that, you will see the plenty of blessings which God wants to give it to. Because a God, Jesus, turns our empty into plenty. May God richly bless you and guide you and keep you safe and prosper you.